<laughs> oh, yo, what's up? Welcome and, to my uh, crib. Oh, this, we, this I guess we could do MTV that, too. <laughs> 15 minutes from the announcements. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. So, they don't get announced till 3, right? 15 minutes till 3. My morning has been so slow, and I feel like I've just been, like, doing chores around the house just to, like, keep myself busy to not go, like, stir crazy. Because usually we work out at, like, 10 or 11. But I feel good. I'm excited. I actually went for a little jog, so I feel like more ready. I don't really want to think about them. I just want to get it done. Not necessarily get them over with, but honestly, quarterfinals, I think, is a, a good layout because you're not rushed, but it's also not, like, too much time. Like, this morning has been slow, but, like, once we get going, there's just the right amount of time for each workout. You can recover really well. And from, like, the past two years, they always have, like, that really long one. But then other than that, I feel like they're really well balanced. You don't leave the weekend, like, feeling fucked up. So I really hope that's the same this year. Yesterday, I just had, like, an active recovery flow. Tuesday, we played pickleball. Yeah, we had crumble. It wasn't a hit week for me, but it was a hit week for everyone else. This is all because of the hurricane, right? I think September, I moved here. And then it came through, like, September, October. Like, I just moved here. Yeah, I think the water was up to, like, here in my whole garage. So then my car was in here, too. So that got totaled. My washer dryer got totaled. Like all this stuff can be replaced. They've still been renovating across the street. Oh really? And it's... Like it's crazy. I think Corinne, when she walked, when you drive into my neighborhood, when she walked in here, she walked waist deep to like get to my house. But they were like, well, I guess we'll go see if it's okay. And I'm like, Corinne, like you did not need to walk in waist deep water to get here. Like there was animals in the water, even just like, you know, something had fallen, like, I don't know, electricity, like yeah. some shit. Like, Crazy. Good friends. Which is like so dangerous. Yeah. We're like, don't do that again. I'm going nowhere. Oh. Did it move? Oh, a little. Part of my cold tub, a piece of that got flooded. All three of these pieces were brand new. It's like so crazy. <laughs> so it'll just go. And then just like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> like, I've never seen it, it just like flop down like that. It's like so janky. I want to like put this here and then, and then get like another picture. Did she have that made? Yeah, on Etsy. Literally perfect. Yeah. Like it's crazy. Oh, okay. Oh wow. Test number one. Okay. Wow. Oh, we got some handstand walks. Not even that many. Chest to wall. Wall That's facing. wall facing. Whoa. Okay. Front squats at 95. Dude, we love this workout. Oh, I do not like this workout. A 12 minute AMRAP. Why are they putting a fucking AMRAP in quarterfinals? You can put this in there because that's bullshit. Interesting. I really like the um, the ones for time though. Yeah, those aren't bad. Yo. Weird ass workouts. Dude, what the fuck? Like a 20 minute AMRAP with fucking BFs? <laughs> what the fuck? I cannot wait to watch grown ass men and women flop on the floor on these BFs. Yeah. They're like, gonna be hard. Dude. It's just a single under on the crossover. Oh, that's great. Make sure I got that. If we do do that jump rope one. I have this rope, which is nice. Moocher. Not for you. Sorry. I kind of like how they have three workouts that are heavy. It's already very different from last year. Yeah. Daniel Brandon, Daniel Brandon quarterfinals, test number two, test number three. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna start again. Like a boom boom. Uh, you can see in your video, like you'll yeah. be able to see. So. <laughs> so you got snacks? Yeah. <laughs> Can't go. Can't survive without snacks. DC, how was that? Judging? Yeah. Easy work. Easy work? It's easy when people move so, so beautifully, you know. <laughs> and uh, 
didn't have to give any no rips, so that's always easy for a judge. How do you feel about day one? It's fun. A little stressful. Are you tired? Are you worn out? I'm, I'm so worn out. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, actually videoing might be more stressful than doing the workout. To submit it? Yeah, stressful. Well, that's just me. I don't know. <laughs> Glad it's over. <laughs> Asking for a friend. It was like making up floor plans, even though you haven't seen them. <laughs> How'd it go? It went very well. Yeah. You know, with, with this workout right here, it's a matter of a clean run. The power clean and jerks build uh, each time, so as you get closer to the end, you're just dealing with more lactic acid. You know, Danielle did very, very well. It's a great way to start. What are we playing here? Secret Hitler. How did you find this game? I knew you were. Uh, I'm like, I played for the last year in college. Found your head. <laughs> it's the cycle speed we all need right there. <laughs> but so it's brand new, it's confusing to everybody. Corinne, who do you trust the most here? Not you. <laughs> I would always pick DC. Like, no, everybody is. Daniel Condon. I trusted Emma once and she trolled oh me so God. bad. No. I chose you or Danica, but now I don't trust you. I gave her Chancellor before. That's why I'm confused. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> he actually said I was liberal. And I'm thinking like fours. Yeah, if four looks good, you hit five, you go, all right, fuck it. And then I'll let you know five again. From your day? Like, yeah. Like mid, I was like, it's hitting me. That's a good time. Yeah. For the fucking no rep. I pulled up and I was like, I know everyone started late. And I told Karen, I was like, Danielle probably got us back on time. <laughs> yes. We got to talk about your adventures last night. My adventures? Did you sleep at all? No, I think I went to bed at like 11. I think I slept till like... 12, 12.30. I'm not like nervous, but I'm always like really excited for today because these workouts, because I know I could like do really well on both of them. So we woke up at like one and I like woke up, took him downstairs to go potty, shit blood. 1.30, two, again, goes shit's blood, have to get up. Three, happens again. And then I think I wake up at like five and I'm like, fuck it. Like I'm not getting any sleep. I'm just gonna take them in anyways because I'm sitting here worrying about it anyways. So I took him in, sat there for like two and a half hours, and then I walk out to my car and I have a flat fucking tire. So then I'm like, can this day get any worse? I was like, maybe I won't make it on time. And look at he feels fine. <laughs> so that was my adventures. No sleep, but did as well as I could on workout one. It sucks because I, I didn't want to have like any excuses for these workouts. You know, I ate really well yesterday. Um, I was gonna get really good sleep. Um, but unfortunately, that's just not how it always goes, and, you know, I did the best I could. And I definitely, like, felt a little tired, but it almost, like, keeps my mind at, at rest. You know, like, when I'm so tired, I just, like, can't even think. Um, you handled it well, like, that... Oh, thank you. That, that like, chaos. Like, yeah. Anxious. It's not just quarterfinals, but we'll make it, you know? Like, if we do what we do, like, we should make it through. Crazy morning. <laughs> not ideal. But we're no. done at three. One more. Done at three, and then hopefully I'll be able to sleep. Okay, I wish I like felt better, but I did what I could. When it hurt, I didn't like back down. I just felt sluggish, yeah. And that's how I probably looked. Was like really just like 
I don't think you look sluggish. You had a look on your face like you're like just determined to do it. Yeah. I was just dead. Oh. I didn't like feel sorry for myself in it. No. Like I was just like, okay, like do what you can, you know? Like, and that feels good walking away from a workout. Knowing like when it got tough, I wasn't just like, you know, oh, I'm tired, I haven't had a lot of sleep. Yeah. I was like, okay, like just do what you can right now. Like that's literally all I can do. Saying the same thing, but a better mindset, I think. Yeah, you look you like know? you got a good mindset going into all the workouts so far. Yeah, yeah, I think so. A lot of just trusting that guy. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking to someone and I was like saying whack-ass words. <laughs> I was like, wait, my mind is all over the place. <laughs> Dallin, how's your fan? It's good. Normally I'm all about like cooling down, but for Danielle, based on how much sleep she had, uh, she performed very well. Uh, you know, I don't know if anyone could perform at a, at a level like that under an hour and a half of sleep. Today was the toughest day. A lot of intense uh, workouts crammed. Um, a lot of good lessons learned, too. All in all, really, really proud of them. Their scores will all be good enough to get them into semifinals. Any lessons we learn now is going to help them prepare better um, and also get a better feel for their training level when, uh, when they're out there competing against other people. Are you going to do both today? Yeah, yeah, I have to. This is a good one for you. Yeah, I really like this one. It's kind of like the first one where um, I know it's a good one for me, so I'm like, oh, I just got to like, yeah, execute. Yeah, you feel a bit of extra. Yeah, so I'm like, ugh. Just like, please execute it. You and Danielle train together quite frequently, right? Yeah, I mean, we're in the gym same times every day. We might not be doing the same stuff every day necessarily, but like, there's been so many positives for both of us. I don't want to speak for her, but for me, like learning some of her like skills and I don't want to call them tricks, but like the high end skill stuff, I can learn a lot from her there. And then. Uh, I hope she learns stuff from me. She says she does, so you'll have to ask her what that is. Uh, but we can definitely like bounce bounce ideas off each other and like different techniques and uh, strategy for things. And then when we do get the opportunity to do a workout together, it's always a serious push, like the clean and jerk one within a second of each other with different strategies. And that's usually how it goes when we throw down. Done. How are you feeling? I feel like there was a ton of lessons this weekend. Um, I'm happy the weekend is over because there was a lot more suffering than I thought there would be. But, you know, I really did learn that sometimes your best effort um, is all that matters. And, like, that, and that's what's going to make people happy. At least I can walk away from this weekend knowing I gave all I could each day, regardless of the circumstances, and 
also sometimes your best effort um, may not be the result you want, but that's why I gotta go back to training and get better. <laughs> right before that workout, I was like, I know I'm gonna go into this workout and my back's gonna hurt. Like I knew. Yeah, rolling GHD workout. I knew my back was gonna hurt and I accepted that. And I think Dom and Matt said like, you have to go into this workout knowing that's gonna happen. And so already like before workout, I know it's gonna be like more than just a, like, more than just one fight, right? Like there's the workout fight and then there's like this pain fight of like my back. All I knew in that moment was if I just gave my best effort and when it did hurt, I didn't give up or feel sorry for myself. Um, that was all that mattered and I can walk away happy. Little guys had some, hard, uh, had some hard times over the last yeah. couple of days. Yeah, it's hard to just, you know, I want to take full responsibility for those things because I feel like in the past I haven't been the best at controlling all the things that I can control. And it sucks to come to this weekend where I feel like I have been doing that. And then like something like this or, you know, lack of sleep, like was kind of out of my control. Um, it's just frustrating. Like you want it to all come together in one weekend, mm -hmm. um, especially a competition weekend. And apparently that's not always the case. Um, and that's when you have to rely on giving your best effort. You got a great team here that I think is extremely supportive and uh, excited for you. Yeah, I do. The toughest thing is just letting them. <laughs> hey, look at eating a bone. Oh, no. a random bone. Oh my god. No. That's <laughs> the weekend. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, congrats. Great job Thank this weekend. You. I think we're gonna get burgers at Lake Park Diner. Yeah. Burger sound. They're good. amazing. It's my favorite burger. All right, burgers it is. So good. Yeah.